Essential Oils 101. Converting your home to a toxin-free environment with ease. Thank you so much for joining us today. Before we get started, we do have to cover the disclaimer, so here it goes. We are not medical professionals. The information shared in this class is not intended to treat, cure, or diagnose any illness, nor is it meant to replace professional medical attention or advice. Advice and testimonials are all based on use of the Young Living brand of oil specifically. Use and application of this information is done solely at your own risk. We believe that when you give the body the support it needs, then the body can take care of itself. We are not experts. You don't need to be an expert to make better choices for your health and wellness. It just takes some research and experimentation. Our journey with Young Living began in May of 2015. In the quest to find ways to help Sarah when Western medicine ran out of answers, we were guided to essential oils. These oils have changed both of our lives dramatically and we have been inspired to share what we have learned with others and support those who are ready for changes in their own lives. Now that you know a little bit more about why we care so much and how we started our own journey, let's talk about those chemicals that are in everyday products we all use in our homes. Dish and laundry soap, fabric softener, air fresheners, cleaning products, hair care and skin care products, etc. The next few slides will show you a list of just some of the chemicals you will want to keep an eye out for and why. I encourage everyone to become friends with Google and start looking more closely at the ingredient list of the products you currently use. I'm not going to read through each one but let's take a closer look at one that is not shown here, but this one hit home to me and my family. Air fresheners. I bring this one up because our house was loaded with them. I love a nice smelling house, and when you're an animal lover with lots of pets, you really want your house to smell good. In the past, I used plug-ins, wax burners, candles, fabric fresheners, air freshening sprays, trusting that they were all safe because I could buy them at my local store. In reality, they were all loaded with toxic chemical ick. These were the first things to get the boot in our house when we realized we were inhaling these fumes all day long without even thinking about it. Some of those dangerous ingredients to avoid, phthalates, formaldehyde, artificial fragrance, 1,4-dichlorbenzene. There are many health risks associated with these ingredients. Endocrine disruption, allergies and asthma, suspected known carcinogens, known to cause hormonal abnormalities, thyroid disorders, birth defects, reproductive problems and they are harmful to our lungs. I know in my own body, I can see where toxic overload was causing some of these exact issues. My respiratory difficulties hit an all-time high when I was using these things in my home. I decided enough was enough and quit using all commercial air fresheners. My solution to toxic air fresheners was replacing them with diffusers. The National Institute of Occupational Safe and Health studied 2,983 ingredients in the various products that we all use at home. They found 884 toxic ingredients. 314 of them caused biological mutations. 218 caused reproductive problems. 778 were toxic to the human body. 146, they knew caused cancer tumors, but they were allowed in the United States, 
even though they were banned in other countries around the world. Makes you think, doesn't it? Many of these chemicals are still allowed in common cleaning supplies in the United States. Things under your cabinet and in your cupboards right this minute. I don't believe that it's a coincidence that mystery illnesses and cancer rates are so high. The number two cause of death in the United States is cancer. 1,620 people a day. One in three cases in the U.S. are directly linked to poor diet, physical inactivity, weight, or chemical exposure. The American Cancer Society says that only 5 to 10 percent of all cancer cases are from gene defect. Five to ten percent. That means 90 to 95 percent of cancer causes are under our own control. It comes back to what we allow into our homes and into our bodies. We have more power than we realize. Did you know that 26 seconds after exposure Chemicals are found in measurable amounts in the human body. In fact, recently, I was using the UW Neurology restroom and immediately noticed their signs, saying only to wash your hands for 20 seconds. This super confirmed my belief in chemicals entering your bloodstream, even with the simple act of washing your hands. Are we really adding toxins in order to take the dirt off? So what are the leading culprits you want to look out for? The top dangerous chemical containing products in our homes are air fresheners, plug-ins, candles, wax burners, chemical cleaning supplies, drain and oven cleaners, furniture polish, dish soap, dishwasher soap, beauty supplies and personal care products, hairspray, gel, shampoo, makeup, facial care. How about something that we've all been using since adolescence? Deodorant. Most deodorant has aluminum in it, and we slather it on our lymph nodes for 70 years. Many scientists believe aluminum exposure may be linked to Alzheimer's and Parkinson's disease. One of the top pollutants in the family home is laundry soap and fabric softener. You wash your clothes in it, and the chemicals stay in your clothes. It outgasses in your closet all night long. It lurks, and it waits for you. You wear it on your skin for the majority of your day. That information we just talked about comes straight from the government, from the U.S. Environmental Protection Agency's Top 10 Killer Household Chemical Study. There are 100,000 chemicals on the market today. The Toxic Substance Control Act of 1976 grandfathered them in. And I always thought grandfathered was a good thing. What does this mean for you? Simply put, these chemicals have not had any safety testing, and we know very little information about their side effects. Dr. Samuel Epstein Chairman of the Cancer Prevention Coalition says it is unthinkable that women would knowingly inflict such exposures on their infants and children and themselves if products were routinely labeled with explicit warnings of cancer risks. But sadly, they are not labeled. Since the 1940s, prostate cancer is up 200%. Thyroid cancer, 155%. Brain cancer, 70%. The American Cancer Association estimates a 50% rise in cancer rates by 2020. With just the brief topics we've covered on chemical-filled products, it's no wonder that the quality of air inside your home is five to seven times more toxic than outdoor air quality. The products we use in our homes directly affect that air quality. I would like to encourage everybody to download the free Think Dirty app and use it on the products you currently have. It's pretty interesting what you'll find out.
What happens when your body's chemically overloaded? You may see it in something as catastrophic as cancer, but most of us feel it in other ways. Lethargy, inability to focus, sleep trouble, chronic inflammation, unexplained pain, skin issues, adult acne, hot flashes, stress and fear. If you face any of these issues, it's time to kick chemicals to the curb. You can control what you allow within the walls of your home. What did we do to help ourselves? After researching options, we chose to make the switch to pure essential oils. Then we researched some more in order to find the brand that we felt confident using in our home for our family, pets, and friends. We love the versatility of the oils in our collection when it comes to taking care of our fur babies. We know with confidence that what we use around our babies is helping them rather than harming them. So what are essential oils? They are the most powerful part of the plant. Essential oils contain the true essence of the plant and are essentially the volatile organic protectors of the plant. They are part of the plant's immune system. Essential oils consist of over 100 different natural organic compounds and are highly concentrated. So a little goes a long way with these babies. Depending on the oil you're using, essential oils are created using different parts of the plant. They're distilled from shrubs, flowers, trees, roots, bushes, fruits, rinds, resins, and herbs. Just how much goes into one of these little bottles of nature's goodness? Here are a couple of examples to show you what goes into a bottle of Young Living Oil. A 15 milliliter bottle of lemon oil takes 75 lemons to create. A 15 milliliter of peppermint oil takes one pound of peppermint plant material. What can essential oils do for you? In humans, they provide support for every system in the body, your skeletal system, muscular system, circulatory system, endocrine system, respiratory system, immune system, and your hormones. They support brain health and a healthy weight. They are used extensively for emotions and spiritual support. The more I use essential oils, the more I realize that there really is an oil for just about everything. There are three main ways to get oils into your body, depending on which aromatic field of study you resonate with. The English apply it topically and rub it into their skin. The French ingest and cook with it. The Germans diffuse and inhale the vapors. In our home, we use all three methods as a part of our daily lives. One of the things I love is how quickly essential oils go to work when I need some extra support. Tests have shown oils reach the heart, liver, and thyroid in three seconds when inhaled. They're found in the bloodstream in 26 seconds when applied topically to the skin. Expulsion of essential oils takes three to six hours in a normal healthy body. Do you or anyone in your family have stressful rough days? An oil in a diffuser can soothe a child's tough day at school and provide a calming effect when you've had one of those stressful days at work. Oils in the diffuser for after school homework or that work project that you need to get finished for the morning can help create a peaceful and focused learning environment. Oils can also be used as an alternative to toxic cleaning chemicals in the home. You can literally start swapping out every single cleaning chemical in your home to live a purer lifestyle. You can also do it without breaking the bank. You don't have to have a huge oil collection in order to enjoy a multitude of oily benefits.
300 oils on earth, but you only need 10 to 20 of them to build yourself a good comprehensive starter kit. It's interesting that some people look at essential oils as a new age fad when they've been around longer than any of us have walked this earth. If we go back thousands of years ago to biblical times, essential oils were first mentioned by name in the biblical book of Genesis, chapter 37, when Joseph was sold to the slave traders. Genesis also ends with the burial of Joseph's father, anointed with myrrh. Oils are mentioned 1,100 times directly or indirectly in scripture. Some of the oldest cultures on earth used essential oils. The Babylonians placed orders for cedarwood, myrrh, and cypress. The Egyptians used essential oils for beauty and embalming. And they have the oldest recorded deodorant recipe that is made with essential oils. Pakistan and Rome used essential oils in the communal bathhouses. They were even used by Jesus, who was given gold, frankincense, and myrrh. Essential oils were used by the medieval Europeans many of whom brought oils back during the Crusades. It was only after World War II, when essential oils were rediscovered, and the science in their uses grows every single year. Look at how long they have been in existence with cultures that have benefited from their myriad of uses. Why wouldn't we continue to use these little gifts from nature to create healthier lives now? essential oils work? In general, I've used essential oils for several years now. When I first started using them, I was not aware of the differences in quality. Lavender smelled nice in my bath, but it never had any significant effect on my body. I used it to buy my essential oils online, in health food stores, and even at the local pharmacy. They were nice smelling, but I didn't receive any therapeutic benefits that I would read about. When I started doing my research, I began to see things more clearly. In the United States, there is no rating system for essential oils. The closest we get is an FDA requirement that in order to label a bottle of essential oil pure or therapeutic grade, the contents of that bottle must contain at least 5% essential oil. Yes, you heard me right. You might be buying a bottle labeled pure therapeutic grade essential oil and only getting 5% of actual pure essential oil in it. After learning this, it was no shocker that I received no real benefits when using my old oils. I am grateful I have since discovered a better way. Let's chat a little bit about the essential oil categories and the differences. All oils in the world fall into one of four categories, grade A, B, C, or D. Grade A are therapeutic, made from organically grown plants and distilled at low temperatures. Grade B are food grade, but may also contain synthetics, pesticides, fertilizers, chemical extenders, or carrier oils. Grade C are perfume oils and often contain adulterating chemicals. They usually use solvents in their distillation process, for example, hexane, to gain a higher yield of oil per harvest. Solvents can be cancerous and are in many of the store-bought oils. Some essential oils may also be diluted 80 to 95 percent with alcohol. Grade D is called floral water, which is aromatic only and is usually a byproduct of grade A distillation. After all the oil and the therapeutic benefits is pulled out of the plant, the leftover floral water is sold to companies who will fill 5% of the bottle with this leftover floral water and fill the rest with carrier oils. And then they slap the label of pure on it. Grade A is the only true pure oil. Grade D would be like walking into your fridge, taking a glass of orange juice and diluting it 95% before you drink it. It wouldn't have the same full benefits of orange juice. That's why you want only grade A oils. Before you purchase your oils, check to see if the company grows, tends, and harvests their own plants, owns their own fields, and controls that entire process from seed to seal 
from the farm to the sealed bottom. Pesticides, pollution, previously farmed land, all of it can affect the quality of the bottled oil. Why would you go the extra step of using an oil to get away from a chemical and then use an oil laden with chemicals? It makes no sense. When we were doing our research to discover the oils we felt confident would bring the most therapeutic benefits to our home, we were guided to Young Living. Young Living oils are grade A. One of the things that stood out to me before I began using their oils is the seed to seal promise. It's a promise of integrity. Gary Young has said that he never makes an oil for profit. He makes it for a purpose. Seed to seal means that each plant is hand weeded. There are no pesticides used, no chemicals, no weed killers. The plants are harvested at their peak. They are then put through a vigorous testing process, both in-house and third party, so you can trust the purity. Then they go from the farm directly to your home. Seed to Seal is not a slogan, it's a promise. You can learn more about why Young Living has grown to become the world leader in essential oils by checking out the Young Living story and falling in love with the company as I have at SeedToSeal.com. I get a lot of questions about why there are such differences in the price ranges of essential oils. Why do companies sell oils more cheaply? Simply put, because they create their oils cheaply to save money. If you spray your crop, crop with pesticides, you will have more crop to distill. If you use a chemical solvent to extract the oil, well, you're going to pull more out. If you dilute it with a cheaper oil or a carrier oil, you'll stretch the oil you have distilled, which increases the bottles of oil you can sell from a single batch. Most essential oils are sold more cheaply because companies cut corners. It takes a great deal of work to produce a tiny amount of essential oil. 60,000 rose blooms, blossoms, provide only one ounce of rose oil. Lavender is abundant. 220 pounds will provide seven pounds of oil. Jasmine flowers must be picked by hand before the sun becomes hot on the very first day they open, thus making it one of the most expensive oils in the world. It actually takes 8 million hand-picked blossoms to produce 2.2 pounds of oil. A sandalwood tree must be 30 years old, 30 feet high, and 90% dead before it's distilled. But a little goes a long way with these essential oils. Most oils are 10 to $30 a bottle. A five milliliter bottle contains about 90 drops. A 15 milliliter bottle contains about 250 drops. Each application is one to three drops. This means that even a small bottle will get you 45 to 90 applications. How about using oils to replace chemical household cleaners? Thieves Household Cleaner is made of plants only and costs about $1.50 a bottle to make. You can't even get that in the organic section at the grocery store. The organic versions of those can run you $4 to $6 per bottle. We only use one capful added to water in our 24 ounce spray bottle for general household cleaning. It replaces a multi-purpose cleaner, glass cleaner, floor cleaner, and more. Are essential oils safe? There are certain oils that are photosensitive, meaning you don't want to wear them on your skin that is exposed to sunlight when you go outside in the sun. These are mostly citrus oils like grapefruit and lemon. Easy solution, just place them where the sun don't shine. When using on your skin, always watch for redness and dilute with a carrier oil. Always dilute oils on children because their skin is more permeable and absorbs the oils more quickly. Be wary of putting the oils topically near the eyes. Some oils like peppermint can cause a burning sensation or eye watering. If you're placing an oil near the eye, apply the oil to a Q-tip instead of tipping the bottle towards your face. 
If you do happen to accidentally get an essential oil in your eye, use a carrier oil like coconut oil in your eye to dilute it. Do not flush it with water. Carrier oil? It's a fatty oil, like olive oil, sweet almond oil, or coconut oil, and its molecules are much larger than those of essential oils. Using a carrier oil with an essential oil slows down the rate the body can absorb the essential oil because it has to ping pong through the larger molecules of the carrier oil to get into your skin. So what about internal use of essential oils? National Association for Holistic Therapy, one of the top aromatherapy schools in the United States, doesn't advocate essential oils for internal use. This actually never made sense to me because if it's a plant that I can eat, why wouldn't I be able to ingest its oily goodness too? That's where the differences in oil brands come in. Most oil companies do not carry any generally regarded as safe essential oils, which have been cleared by the FDA. NAHA also bases a lot of their decisions on the British model, which advocates topical use only. Many of the British studies are flawed. For example, done using extremely high doses, or in ways that oils would never actually be used, like pouring a whole bottle inside your body. Young Living utilizes all three methods, British, French, German. The French have been safely using some essential oils internally for decades. Young Living has created a vitality line with distinctive labels so you can easily recognize which oils are safe to take internally. I challenge you to look at the ingredients list of what you have in your bathroom and kitchen. After class, I'll add a couple of checklists so you can feel free to use those as a base. Every day, we put products on our skin and in our body and breathe them in but many of these products contain damaging chemicals. The average woman applies over 300 chemicals a day to her body, just through soaps, makeup, shampoos, and hair care products. 80 of those chemicals are applied every day before breakfast. Mind blowing, isn't it? When you use Young Living Essential Oils, you are using a product with one ingredient, like lemon, oregano, tangerine, no additives, and no chemical yuck. Is all this a little bit overwhelming? Just take a deep breath. It doesn't have to be. It's a learning journey and so much fun once you start. Let me tell you how I fully dived into my oily journey when I got serious about healthy changes for my home with the Young Living Starter Kit. It's the only thing on the Young Living website that is half off. If you're a frugal shopper like me, this is the biggest bang for your buck. It comes with 11 bottles of oil and a diffuser. The oils in this kit are truly everyday oils and help create the perfect foundation. In fact, two years later, I still use every single one of these oils in my daily life. Essential oils have so many uses. It is mind boggling. I am just going to discuss a few oils and a few of their many benefits, but would like to encourage you to look up a little more information on any that really catch your eye. You'll be amazed at how many different benefits you can receive in one little bottle. Frankincense. This quickly became a favorite of mine when I got my starter kit. It has become an oil that I use every single day in a variety of ways. I diffuse frankincense during meditation for grounding, centering, and spiritual support. I also quickly discovered how useful it was for my own respiratory support and supporting my overall immune system. I add frankincense to my skin moisturizer as it is one of the top skincare oils. You can also rub it on the bottom of your feet to help alleviate nervous energy, and it's a fantastic oil for mood support. Frankincense can be useful in your oral health. It also has been known to help aid your digestive system. I've only touched on a few, but I would encourage you to look it up later and see the full myriad of benefits that this little gem will bring into your life. Lavender. 
lavender. Lavender oil is one of the most beneficial essential oils in the world, and it's been referenced for well over 2,000 years. Lavender oil is sort of a jack-of-all-trades oil. If you aren't sure what oil to use, you typically cannot go wrong by grabbing lavender and giving it a go. Most people have heard about lavender in regards to helping with relaxation, but that's really just the tip of the iceberg. Yes, diffusing it creates a calming and soothing aroma, and it is the perfect oil to add to your diffuser before bed. I like that it has helped me to get better sleep, and it also helps soothe my overall nervous feelings that I tend to get. You can use it to help relax after a long day by adding a few drops to a nighttime bath or with some Epsom salts for added detoxing benefits. The bonus is also the soothing this will give your tired muscles as well, especially after working out. It can calm and soothe your body systems and is one of the top oils to help support healthy skin. It's a very gentle oil, and it's safe to use with your beloved canine friends with proper dilution. We have five dogs in our fur family, and we use this oil frequently with them. It is one of the main ingredients in the chill dog roller ball I created for our anxious little Chihuahua Vivi. Our little girl now asks us for her roll on when her nerves need some extra calming support. When our furry Zeus gives himself itchy hot spots, a little lavender oil mixed with coconut oil helps soothe his skin. Since lavender is so beneficial for your skin, we keep this one close at hand in the kitchen too. I have used it on my own burns, cuts, scrapes, and insect bites to help speed relief. It is also a great oil to use after sunning and to soothe dry skin as well. I also like to use it in my hair conditioner and my face moisturizer. Lavender is also called the Swiss Army Knife of oils because of its many uses. Peppermint. Oh, peppermint. I love this oil, and I use it all the time. Have you ever had it in brownies? Yum. Initially, I was drawn to it for its respiratory support properties. It is one oil in my collection that I never let run out. It is also one of the three oils in the LLP combo, lemon, lavender, and peppermint, to help ease seasonal discomfort. It's actually my first season using LLP, and let me tell you, my household has been using LLP a lot and couldn't be happier with how much it is helping us have a fantastic spring so far. Peppermint also supports gastrointestinal comfort, promotes healthy bowel function, and enhanced healthy gut function. It is a wonderful addition to help maintain efficiency of the digestive tract. I've also been known to get some horrific headaches from tight neck muscles. Rubbing peppermint oil with a little carrier into my brick-like neck muscle helps bring me a lot of comfort. I usually add a little to my temples at the same time. It's also a good oil to use on your muscles after exercise, and it may support performance during activity. Peppermint is another oil that's a good addition to natural oral health care and helps give you that minty fresh breath without adding chemical ick. Do you spend a lot of time on your feet? Sometimes we need to show our tired, overheated, and overworked tootsies some extra love. Try adding some peppermint oil to a cold water compress for a cooling effect. Peppermint is invigorating and can help you with a natural pick-me-up. I enjoy peppermint vitality, adding it to my drinking water with a little lemon vitality oil. It's very refreshing, uplifting, and helps me focus. Purification. Purification is a blend of citronella, rosemary, lemongrass, tea tree, lavender, and myrtle oils. It is a favorite oil in the summertime, and it helps keep those pesky pests away. I always make sure I have an extra bottle or two on hand before buggy season starts because this one does tend to go out of stock that time of year. You can diffuse it while sitting outdoors or use it in a spray to enjoy an annoyance-free outdoor experience. Purification is our go-to air freshener in our home. When diffused, it helps eliminate the odors. It doesn't just cover them up, it gets to the source. You can add a couple drops to cotton balls and put them inside stinky shoes to freshen them overnight. I also like to keep a tub of baking soda in the laundry room with several drops of purification mixed in. I add some to every load of laundry when I add my laundry detergent. 
Some people also like to put a couple drops on a wet towel and throw it in the dryer during the dry cycle. Mixed with baking soda, it also makes a wonderful non-toxic and super fresh smelling carpet fresh. Purification makes a great DIY room spray to replace chemical laden commercial sprays. You can also use it to help scrub away mildew, so it's a wonderful addition to your chemical free cleaning supplies. How about skin benefits? Add to a carrier oil to moisturize your skin or for a soothing massage for your feet. There is so much more I could say about this one. Let's just say you are going to love it. Thieves. Thieves is probably the most well-known essential oil from Young Living. This oil benefits your body by helping to support your immune system in your personal journey to achieve and maintain wellness. This oil can take internally with Thieves Vitality in gel caps or add a spicy zing to beverages. I love Thieves Tea with Thieves Oil, Lemon Oil, and some honey. You can use it topically and all around your house to help support you and your family. I keep an immune boosting roll on that has Thieves as a dominant part of the blend and use it every day to support my immune system. I'm happy to report that I can't remember the last time I had a cold or the flu. Thieves oil is used for immune support and purifying. Here's a little history from the website on where the inspiration for this product actually came from. Thieves essential oil blend was inspired by the legend of four 15th century French thieves who formulated a special aromatic combination composed of clove, rosemary, and other botanicals they used while robbing the dead and dying. Young Living's one-of-a-kind Thieves Blend, crafted in the spirit of that legendary combination, can be found in all of our Thieves household and self-care products. When taken internally, Thieves supports healthy immune function, and it includes eucalyptus essential oil, which may help maintain a healthy respiratory system. When taken as a dietary supplement, Thieves is an ideal complement to a daily wellness regime. Stress Away. This blend is one of the top emotional support oils. It promotes wellness and may be an important part of a daily health regime. Relaxing and comforting, it is a blend of copaiba, lime, cedarwood, vanilla, acotilla, and lavender. This is a fantastic oil to use in a rollerball for on-the-go busy lives. We all know how stressful life can get, and we have to-do lists a mile long at any given time. You can keep it in your bag for on-the-go relaxation in a bottle. It is also a wonderful oil to diffuse at the end of the day to help you relax and unwind. I like to combine five drops of stress away with two drops of peppermint in my diffuser for an amazing thin mint cookie aroma. Lemon is uplifting and refreshing, making it a wonderful mood support oil to add to your oily arsenal. One of my favorite diffuser combos to use after a long day is three drops of lemon and three drops of lavender for an uplifting and relaxing experience. Lemon can also be a wonderful addition to natural cleaning products. Lemon Vitality Oil is great for enhancing the taste of food and water. It is also a key ingredient in Thieves Oil. As with all citrus oils, it may also help support the immune system. Panaway. Panaway is a blend of wintergreen, elchrysium, clove, and peppermint and is used topically. It's a wonderful oil blend for athletes and anyone who needs a little muscle soothing support after exercising. Apply it to the back of the neck for a soothing aromatic experience. Panaway also supports the appearance of healthy skin coloration. Copaiba. Copaiba is one of those oils that promotes overall wellness and supports nearly every system in the body. And don't you just love the name? Copaiba supports the cardiovascular system, emotional balance, muscles and bones, nervous system, respiratory system, and skin and hair. It is also one of the key oils in the Stress Away blend. Digize. 
The Hygienize Essential Oil is one of Young Living's most unique essential oil blends, combining tarragon, ginger, peppermint, juniper, lemongrass, anise, and patchouli oils for a spicy, exotic, aromatic blend. Hygienize Oil also includes fennel essential oil, the use of which dates back to ancient Egypt. A top oil for supporting the digestive system, you can take it internally with peppermint to stimulate your digestion, either in water or a veggie cap. You can also apply it topically to your abdomen. Use it at every meal to support healthy digestion or whenever you need a little extra support. RC. RC is a blend that I fell in love with right away. It was a game changer for my body. It's done wonders in supporting my respiratory system. The combination of three different types of eucalyptus, myrtle, spruce, peppermint, pine, lavender, marjoram, and cypress. This one has benefited me so much since joining Young Living, and I always make sure I have a backup bottle. You can enjoy it in a diffuser. I find the scent is invigorating. If you need additional respiratory support, you could try using it steamed over a bowl or shower, or as a chest rub, to bring comfort to the lungs and throat. It would also be wonderful in a massage. Since I began using RC, I've discovered my favorite way to use this oil is in an essential oil inhaler, and I always have it close at hand when I need a little extra help. These are just a few of the many uses these oils and benefits you may receive. Why are we so passionate about sharing? because we know that you need them in your home as a part of a simple chemical-free lifestyle. When you see what the oils do for your own body and how they help create a chemical-free home, it's impossible to walk into the homes of your friends and family members and see their bright blue dish soap or their chemical-laden shampoo that's pumping toxins into their bloodstream in 26 seconds and not speak out about what you've discovered yourself. You share it because you love and you care for your friends and you want to see them living a long and healthy life. We share it because we love everyone and we hold the vision of helping to create a healthier world. When you take steps to take care of yourself, you can fully do whatever your heart calls you to do. Freedom to create a life that brings you joy. Let me get real with you for a moment as I wrap up and tell you the true reason I teach so emphatically about this. Why does chemical-free living matter so much to me? Because I have seen the other end of a chemical-filled lifestyle. I want everyone to know what they're putting in and on their bodies. I took a leap of faith, and I purchased my starter kit, and began right where you are right now, taking this chemical-free living thing one day at a time, kicking one chemical out of my home at a time. You can do this! It's all about taking small steps and saying, no more. I will not allow these things in my home. You can't control all the places that you're exposed to toxins, but you are the gatekeeper of your own home. Learn alongside our team. Let us guide you through the process with easy, simple steps. Step one is to start with the starter kit, a diffuser and 11 bottles of oil a collection of some of the most common oils on earth for supporting systems of the body. They have just one ingredient. Lemon is just cold pressed lemon rinds. Frankincense is resin, properly distilled at the right temperature to make essential oil. Lavender is freshly distilled at the peak of harvest with thousands of uses in the home. Let us come alongside you and train you how to kick these toxic chemicals to the curb. You can do this. Before we show you how to get your starter kit, we want to cover the Essential Rewards pro Program and the benefits. This is something we wish we would have taken advantage of on day one and regret not joining it right away. So I just want to make sure that you know that it's about this bonus option. It truly makes chemical-free living affordable. So here is a simple explanation. Number one, freebies. If you spend 100 PV, 190 PV, 250 PV, 300 PV, etc. on your essential rewards order, you can get oodles of freebies every single month. In fact, the monthly promos always include exclusive bonuses 
that are only for Essential Rewards members. For example, when you join Essential Rewards with an additional 50 PV order at the time that you buy your starter kit, you will already be at the 100 PV Essential Rewards level, which means you get a free gift. The rewards just go up from there. In order to qualify for ER rewards, your purchases must all be on your monthly ER order. Number two, cheaper shipping. Have you checked out the shipping rates later, lately? Who doesn't want this bonus? Number three, cash back. For the first three months that you're on ER, you get 10% cash back in YL credit. On month four, you get 20% back, and after 25 months, you get 25% back. We have gotten a lot of free oils and oily products by cashing in our rewards points. In fact, frankincense is a daily multi-use oil in our household. We have never had to buy a bottle of frankincense outside of the one we got in our starter kit. That's just one of the awesome ways that we use our ER points. This is also how we discovered the amazing benefits of Ningxia Red. Our very first ER points cash in order. We ordered a four pack of Ningxia Red. Wow, amazing stuff. Number four, ER extra savings bonus kits that can only be purchased on Essential Rewards. The Ningxia Essential Rewards kit, for example, costs $1.16 an ounce instead of $1.60 an ounce. Since we both like to drink it, it is the cheapest way to buy Ningxia. The same is true of the Thieves Essential Rewards Kit. Number five, the requirements. You must spend 50 PV a month to place an Essential Rewards order. You can always change the date to a better date for you. Then you must check your cart before your ship date and update it. It will leave the items in your cart from last month. Why? Because most people use this to order the same supplements every month and they don't want to keep adding them in month after month. You will want to make sure that you have what you want saved in your cart by your chosen ER date. If you decide to be a business builder, you have to spend 100 PV to get your full paycheck. This is a good idea anyway because it gets you familiar with all Young Living has to offer. We find it is helpful in better serving our customers with first-hand knowledge. If you are on ER, you get 10% back right away. That would mean that you're only spending $90, and that's better financial stewardship. It is a wiser way to get paid. Number six, did I mention gifts? Gifts at months three, six, nine, and 12, and then yearly after that. We just got a free Thieves Vitality for our six month gift. If we invited you, then this following directions are for you. Start by heading to youngliving.com and click on become a member. Enter my member number in the sponsor and enroller boxes, number 2944851. Once you enter the sponsor and enroller number, it will take you to a second page. The second page asks which starter kit you want. All the diffuser kits come with the same oils and extra goodies. Only the diffuser is different and will have a different price range. Our personal favorite is the Aria. We love her. She is amazing. Her kit costs $260 and she truly is the Mac Daddy of diffusers. The Rainstone diffuser kit is 205. We love the sleek black color of this one. The Dewdrop and Home Diffuser kits are the same price at $160. We personally own and use both of these diffusers and would recommend them. After that, we'd like to encourage you to sign up for the optional ER program. You can pick individual products, kits, or a combo of both, whatever meets your nutritional and household needs. We do recommend the Thieves Essential Rewards kit because in one swoop, it contains just about all you need to get rid of nearly every chemical cleaner in your home. It is simple and easy. If you're taking chemical free living head on, this is the best place to start. The next step, ask for your personal information and payment. The final step shows you a summary of your order and you hit activate and check out to begin your life changing oily journey. 
This is something you need to take seriously. No one is watching your home but you. You are the gatekeeper. And I'd be willing to bet my life that there are things in your home right now that you're exposed to every single day. Things that could be slowly killing you. The thing is, it is totally preventable. We care about your health and well-being. We were toxic ourselves at one time. That is why we are so passionate about helping others kick chemicals to the curb before it's too late. We are honored to have you as a part of this team. Please connect with us on Facebook. So, what do you do until the box arrives? You start small, you start slow. Start with what you're convicted on. Let me give you a simple tip. With your food, flip the labels over and start reading the ingredients. If you can't pronounce it, don't eat it. It doesn't mean you can't have ice cream. Just go for the ice cream that says milk, sugar, eggs, and vanilla, instead of an ingredient list of several items that you can't pronounce. Keep your ingredient list clean. With your home, start with the biggest offenders. First, laundry soap, dish soap, cleaning supplies, candles, plug-ins, wax burners. Toss them, donate them, swap them out with a diffuser and pure essential oil. There is oil-infused thieves cleaner, laundry soap, and dish soap. It's affordable, concentrated, long-lasting, and simple to use. This is about small, simple baby steps. Take it one month at a time and swap things out in your home. Maybe the first month you focus solely on thieves and you toss your cleaning supplies. You can start that today by grabbing a $22 bottle of thieves cleaner. Whoa, $22 for a bottle? Well now, let me tell you how long one bottle lasts our household with five dogs and assorted other critters. Our first bottle lasted a year. So go home and wipe your kitchen down and fall in love knowing with confidence that you just gave a boost to your immune system instead of taxing your liver. Not bad for $22 a year. Add a hand soap, toothpaste, and hand sanitizer to round out your first month of kicking chemicals out. The next month, Swap out laundry soap, dish soap, and add thieves spray. Month three, focus on your personal care products, deodorant and shampoo. Month four, beauty supplies like face wash. Taking care of your skin is so important. Every day you leave makeup on, your skin ages by seven days. Time to use a chemical free option to get it off. The Young Living Art Line is my absolute favorite. We started this journey two years ago with the Young Living Starter Kit and have never looked back. We use the oils every single day in our home, on ourselves, on our pups, critter cage cleaning, and we even add delicious zing to our snacks and beverages. We've also incorporated some of the fantastic line of nutritional supplements that Young Living has to offer. Every oil you use or supplement you use is a chemical that you are not using. You matter, your family matters, your friends matter. You can take control of your own health, kicking the chemicals out of your life and start living clean. Thanks so much for joining us today. If you have any questions at all, please let us know. We are here only to be truly helpful.